Hi, I'm Brandon. And I'm Jodie Lee. And welcome back to By Faith, where we're on Lesson 11, Friday. Yes, and it is the wrap-up, right? So this week, the whole week, we've been learning about work. And today, we're just going to touch on some of the key points that we thought were cool and encourage you that if you've missed any of our videos, go check them out. I'm going to make sure that you're ready to discuss them at church or youth group or Zoom call or whatever it is, or actually just make sure that you have um, got all there is to get out of this week's lesson study. Um, Brian, do you have any thoughts you want to start us off with um, about work this week? Yes, yeah, so what I got from this lesson was that one, Work is super important for us, you know. God didn't give it to us because he wanted to see us suffer and slog and go to bed late every night with back pain. <laughs> um, man has made slaves out of other men and have made work uh, difficult and often case unnecessarily difficult. Mm -hmm. uh, but what God intended for us was just wholesome work to keep our minds busy that we wouldn't be distracted and uh, let our minds wander upon evil thoughts, but good wholesome stuff to keep us busy. And the other thing was, don't be a couch potato. Stop <laughs> it, you know? Like, get off get off the couch, get off Netflix. Uh, it's, it's nice, I know. It's, it's easy to sit there the whole day and just watch, but it's not helping you. It's not benefiting your spiritual life. It's not benefiting uh, your professional life. It's not benefiting the relationships within your life. So, so stop it. <laughs> too much is uh, too much. You know what that, you know, you know how much that is. Um, if it's becoming a problem in your life, get off it, leave it and just uh, spend some time with God, spend some time uh, learning about uh, His desire and His will for your life and get out there and try and make a positive difference. That's awesome, Brandon. I think um, you're yeah, encouraging us to actually go and get out there and work um, is important. And what I already learned um, is that when work was created, it was actually created like in the Garden of Eden, which is where everything was perfect. And God and Adam were going to name the animals together. Um, and then when sin came in, work became this horrible, well, sometimes horrible thing that we know today, right? But God doesn't want us to experience that with work. He wants to give us a purpose and um, that, that sense of achievement, right? Um, and there's a famous verse in Proverbs, I think, and it's like this, the, the lazy man starves because he can't even lift his um, hand to his face, right? Um, and that's the thing is when you, when we're lazy, it might feel nice, but you actually miss out on other opportunities yeah. and you miss out on like so many blessings for yourself and for other people. So I think it's been a good, a good week of us learning that we need to work hard. Um, and I hope that we'll remember that as we go into next week. Um, but now it's Sabbath, so we get to rest. Yes. yes. <laughs> um, and that's also important, right? You need to rest so that you can work and be um, hardworking. So yeah, I think the key verse was, I think, Corinthians 10 verse 31, which is basically whatever you do, do it to the glory of God. Amen. So whether you're eating, whether you're sweeping like Brandon, whether you're editing videos like Brandon, um, whatever you do, <laughs> you must do it to the glory of God and use it as a way that you can bless others and show them God's love. So yeah, that's all from me. That's awesome. So Should guys, we? let's close our eyes and let's pray. Heavenly Father God, we want to thank you for coming to this earth and dying for us that we may be saved from our sin, Lord. And not just saved from our sin, but also saved from those dreaded cultures that seek <laughs> to transform us into potatoes, Lord. <laughs> so, Father God, we pray that you'll be with us, uh, look after us, help us to be more productive, and uh, not just productive in the world, but in uh, your work that you wish to do alongside us. Pray this in your wonderful and holy name. Amen. Amen. Bye. <laughs> Bye.